What's up guys, back with another video. Today, I kinda just wanna talk about the current downtrend that we're in, in Solana NFTs particularly, but really in NFTs in general. And uh, kind of my more general understanding of bear markets and market psychology. So um, I'm just gonna get right into it. In, uh, in the stock market, in markets in general, my favorite word is capitulation. Now this is kind of a phenomenon that happens at the end of a downtrend. And what capitulation means is kind of just a fancy word for give up. But it basically refers to when everybody uh, just gives up and the people who were holding on and thought that maybe they were diamond hands and ended up not being diamond hands, they just completely give up and, um, you know, admit defeat. And this is basically necessary at the end of major downtrends. You need the last of the weak hands to shake out so that the true diamond hands are left. And at this point, there's way more buyers than sellers. Um, <clears throat> Sometimes bear markets, just like in crypto in 2017, can last for years. But I don't think that this NFT bear market will last for years. At, you know, this current one. Um, mainly because we're still in a bull market in crypto in general. Um, but also just because NFTs, the cycles tend to move much faster. It's much more volatile. So um, I think people are going to capitulate sooner than later. Um, as I've said in past videos, I think that, uh, um, you know, I think all coins will probably go on a, a major rally before we do see a major uptrend again in NFTs, but, um, <clears throat> I'm still, I'm still mostly holding. Um, I did actually go a little bit crazy on Goblin Laboratory, but that's the only thing I've been buying is Goblin Laboratory. Um, probably went a little bit too crazy. Got a bunch of them. But I do have conviction in the project. Um, I think the art is awesome. The team is great. They're super active in the Discord. Um, you know, there's an interesting roadmap where they're going to partner with other projects. They're actually airdropping um, this completely separate project to every single uh, Goblin experiment owner. So that's pretty cool. Um, uh, and obviously it's got the same artist as uh, Galactic Geckos. Um, and I, I really just personally like the project. Um, some of it comes down to personal taste. I know the art probably isn't for everybody. Uh, but I like, yeah, I like the art. And I like that they're innovating, you know, with this whole laboratory thing where the holders can edit the, uh, the art, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I'm holding that. Um, Still holding my Doge Capital. Really haven't sold anything, uh, you know, lately. Um, I'm sure just as everybody else, it would have been nice if I took even more profits during the last uptrend. But I think, you know, we're all learning as we go. I think most of us are pretty new to these NFTs. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to give my overall outlook on market sentiment. And, you know, don't be those last people to give up because then you're going to feel stupid if you end up, uh, you know, I know probably like a week ago, everybody's like, oh, diamond hands, you know, never going to sell. Some of those people are selling now. Some of those people are giving up. They're capitulating. Um, and you don't want to be the ones to capitulate right at the bottom of, of the downtrend. So uh, that's my thoughts. None of this is financial advice. We could all just lose all of our money. NFTs are extremely risky. They uh, And yeah, so be careful out there. Hopefully you're somewhat diversified into cryptos as well. You know, I got stocks as well, plenty of stocks. Um, really only probably about, probably less than 50% of my uh, investments is in crypto. So, um, so yeah, I'm not worried about the NFTs. Uh, definitely bullish long term. So you guys have a good day. If you like the video, leave a like and subscribe. See you next video.